this here is the uh, most expensive one to uh, ten millimeter drill bit set you uh, can get from Banggood. But most of you will probably have to buy them unless you have a uh, YouTube channel with a few subscribers then you can probably get them uh, for free just like me. Packaging is uh, certainly a bit more uh, substantial than a uh, plastic bag although a uh, plastic bag would have been fine with me uh, I'm not sure about this uh, plastic drill index it seems to be already broken Yeah, piece of the uh, piece of the hinge uh, broke off. Oh, it's pretty useless. Um, let's uh, put these in uh, an old uh, metal drill uh, index. Well, uh, that definitely could use a little cleanup. I'll be right back. Well, I gave these a uh, visual inspection and I can tell you they look like drill bits. Nice uh, drill bits, nothing wrong with them. And they have a very interesting and uh, special ground tip. I'm not sure if you can see that uh, on camera, but uh, it is uh, stepped. Uh, I'm not sure what that is uh, good for, but it's interesting. It will be hard to uh, regrind by hand, but uh, they should also work with a normal uh, ground tip. According to this uh, plastic container, these uh, drill bits are made from M42 high speed steel. And that uh, probably explains uh, the higher price than uh, what is usual for Chinese drill bits. Um, high speed steel with uh, cobalt can handle uh, higher temperatures and that's probably a good thing because it says here that these uh, drill bits are grinding fairly and uh, dull drill bits can uh, get pretty warm grinding fairly here it is again I don't know who came up with that uh, slogan but it sure doesn't uh, inspire uh, confidence these uh, drill bits uh, feel pretty sharp by the way so somebody definitely uh, didn't uh, think this through in my opinion of course alright now it's time uh, to test these a little bit and I still have to uh, finish this boring bar holder that I was making so let's drill some holes and uh, put in some uh, set screws and I guess I'm going to use uh, the uh, five millimeter drill bit because uh, then I can uh, thread the holes with uh, M6 
Uh, six or seven more to go, but I can do that uh, off camera. Well, all the holes have been uh, drilled. And uh, that is a bit surprising, considering how bad the uh, drill bit tip looks. Um, I think it may have gotten damaged when uh, it took the uh, workpiece for a spin, when I uh, used both hands to force in the uh, drill bit. Oops. Well, that's some plus points for the drill bit. It didn't break. Um, but to be honest, I think this uh, M42 high speed steel bit is uh, just too brittle for this uh, piece of streptonium. And uh, drilling these 3.3mm uh, holes um, for the set screws to set the uh, tooltip height was a whole lot easier. And uh, by the way, that 3.3mm uh, uh, drill bit was a um, M35 high speed steel cobalt uh, drill bit also uh, from Banggood. Um, later I'll try uh, another drill bit, but first I want to finish this uh, boring bar holder. This is a uh, set of Banggood tabs ranging from uh, M3 to uh, M12. And uh, as you can see, these did come in a plastic bag, but uh, that's not a point I want to make. I bought these after reviewing that uh, disappointing uh, set of tabs and dies last winter. You know the one where the uh, first stage or uh, the taper tab already made a uh, fully fitting and uh, very sloppy thread. These on the other hand uh, make a surprisingly nice fitting uh, thread. And I thought that was uh, worth mentioning, especially uh, considering the price. Although so far I have only uh, used the M6 and uh, the M8 uh, tab. And I guess it's now time uh, to test uh, the M6 a little more. This is uh, my first set of uh, spiral uh, tabs and uh, I like how the uh, chips come out on top. Although I don't think it's a good idea to back off the uh, tab to uh, break the uh, chip. Tapping one-handed, probably a good method to uh, break a tip. Yeah. I'm already through. No play. But sometimes it uh, feels tighter than it actually is because uh, some of the uh, chips get stuck on the underside. It's all the way in at the moment. I can feel the uh, end of the bolt. It's slightly uh, protruding into the hole and as you can see there's a uh, very little play in the thread I think that's a good result alright seven more to go but I will do that uh, off camera well it uh, finally happened I have uh, broken my first step ever accidentally that is so it's uh, bye bye record 
I thought it was a good idea to uh, do a test piece with this uh, M4 spiral tab considering I have hardly any experience with uh, spiral tabs um, I kept turning the uh, tapping wrench till it uh, got very hard to move at that point I uh, backed it off slightly and uh, continued threading and uh, before I knew it it uh, just snapped off well on the upside I guess now I can finally sell that uh, EDM machine because uh, its protection against uh, breaking tabs clearly has worn off and uh, I will have to use my old tabs to uh, thread those uh, 3.3 millimeter holes with an M4 thread easy without uh, backing off to break the chip now this uh, tab hasn't seen uh, much use but uh, it definitely worked a lot better than that uh, M4 spiral tab of course this was the uh, taper tab so I will have to do it again with a uh, what's it called a plug tab this is uh, the second stage or the uh, plug tab but uh, considering its uh, length or the lack of length I probably will also have to use the uh, bottoming tab Hmm, bolt uh, doesn't want to start. I guess I will run that uh, bottoming tab through there. Alright, let's try that bolt again. getting tighter I think there must be some chips in there I will uh, run the uh, tab through the hole again I must say that uh, threading smaller sizes is a lot more difficult than uh, regular sizes like M8 and M10 the uh, tap might not be long enough to uh, thread all the way to the uh, bottom it won't go any deeper I might have to countersink these holes. I found a, a different style tab in my uh, collection and this uh, should go in deep enough to uh, finish the uh, thread. Yeah I can feel it so that's done I still have to do the other one but I won't show that because this is getting boring quickly if I was you I would have switched to another video a long time ago 
one final step I gotta clean up those uh, burrs on the inside of the hole so I'm going to run the reamer through the hole again that should do it hopefully because the uh, boring bar might need to uh, rotate a little inside the holder I am making the uh, set screws a little convex That should do it. Well, seven more to go and four more small ones. So that's finally, finally finished. And I guess now I can uh, start working on making a backing plate for that old uh, Cushman shock. But you know, summer is almost here. And this time of the year, the leaf is uh, starting to wind down over here in the uh, tool temple but first I need to test another one of those uh, um, M42 cobalt uh, drill bits this here is a piece of uh, stainless scraptonium that I found at the uh, local scrap yard and we all know that uh, stainless is uh, fairly hard so let's try and uh, punch a hole through this with those uh, fancy drill bits looks like I got about uh, four tenths of a millimeter run out it's not great but uh, it'll do for drilling a hole this here is a tenth of a millimeter filler gauge and as you can see the uh, chuck jars are a bit uh, bell mouthed but nothing I can do about that uh, at this point but I might uh, try and uh, regrind those jaws uh, some other time I had to uh, reshim the uh, tool bit hopefully this time it's on center height that will do a little bit faster this is a 400 rpm hopefully this thing won't break that's enough here's a proof that this is in fact a stainless steel not magnetic that might be a highly enriched uranium who knows let's start with a pilot hole and this is the three and a half millimeter drill bit and here is a before picture And we are running 400 RPM.
Well, uh, let's fill up the flutes one more time. I guess it's time to stop. This is a four times a digital zoom. I think it looks okay, but uh, I will also make a uh, macro picture and edit uh, that in. Look at that! It actually is grinding fairly. Let's uh, find out if it will also drill. Yeah, that works fine. Flutes are starting to fill up. Well, that's it for the uh, five millimeter drill bit. Last uh, test, the uh, ten millimeter drill bit. I'll slow down the lathe a little. That's 300 RPM. Well, it's cutting on both flutes, so that's a good thing. And I was hoping that the uh, special step ground would help with the uh, breaking of the uh, chip. But um, that definitely is not the case. I'm getting a nice uh, bird nest. But it is drilling very acceptable. Alright, I'm at the bottom of the hole. I think it's easier to uh, push this drill in than that uh, pilot uh, drill. But uh, as soon as the uh, flutes fill up, it's uh, getting really hard. And that's now now that's enough testing I think both pilot and uh, 10 millimeter drill bits worked uh, fairly well and it looks like the uh, pilot uh, drill got some wear on the uh, corner of the cutting edge but that's uh, fairly common in my experience um, the uh, reground 5mm drill bit was also uh, working fairly well and uh, talking about the 5mm uh, drill I was uh, disappointed that it lost its uh, tip when I drilled those holes in uh, the uh, boring bar uh, holder it uh, took a lot of force to get the drill going and uh, that's why I was stupid enough to put uh, both hands on the uh, drill press handle um, I must say that normally I would have used a uh, pilot drill even for a 5mm hole but uh, 
with that special stepped uh, ground tip I hoped it would not be necessary to be honest I think it uh, might have been a bit dull from the start or uh, some chunks broke off immediately after I started drilling it uh, sure sounded that way it's just too bad I didn't make a before picture all in all I think uh, these are fairly good uh, drill bits but if you are an amateur just like me and you're just playing a bit with your life I think you might be uh, better served with those uh, M35 high speed steel drill bits that uh, Banggood also sells they are less than half the price of uh, these uh, drill bits and the uh, set that I bought last year has uh, done fairly well for me but uh, ask me again what I think about these in uh, six months time I might have uh, completely changed my mind um, well that's it for me till next time